bushcraft life here and I'm just gonna be showing you guys my camp update again or yeah just on my house and I've been looking for something to insulate my house with or just put on top so this is like not really much out here so I was looking around and uh, I found these they're everywhere well I kind of took them out a lot of them but they're annoying you untie your shoes when you walk uh, they scratch your legs uh, they do a lot of things. it hurts so I was like why not just rip them out of the ground and just use them if all they do is nothing pretty much they just sit there so yeah I rip them out I put them up here and I know they're probably not going to do good against rain if it does rain but I could just just probably put ferns from down that way it's a big area of ferns I could lay them down against this so the rain could come down and I'll probably have to this tree right here in the center of my house the rain if it does rain it will just run down that and right in my house so I'll probably have to tie something around it or do something about that cause that's gonna be a problem so I've ran out of here I ran out of those things I left the small ones so they can grow I don't know how they drop their seeds or whatever. I, I don't know much about these. So I just keep coming over here and just rip them out. And some of them have very long roots, so I just whack the dirt off because I don't want it to get in my house or anything. Just, just rip them off. Yeah, this one's got a really long root. If they did have all that dirt, I just whack it up against this tree. So it's decently clean. And then I'll just come. I find a good spot. Every day there's an opening. Place this up there and I put it in there. And it's getting tougher to get wood out here now. Because we've knocked down all the dead ones. And uh, I'm trying to go. I don't really want to bring axes, shovels, man-made things around here. I'm trying to make it all myself. It makes it a little bit funner. Probably go find rocks, foot nap them. I don't really know how to foot nap, so I'll probably just find a rock that is pretty much sharp enough to be an axe. Yeah. And these things again. If you guys know anything that I can do with them besides that, like, I don't know, making rope out of them or is anything edible about them or if they're even poisonous if I'm like getting poison on myself right now I don't even know so yeah I'll show you guys the insides yeah the roots are coming through so I'm gonna have to cut those with my knife and I've gotten some stuff done out here I found I've cut this one down today I'm gonna put like three more maybe the wall, mm, I'm not so good right now. And the houses, my brothers, is remaining the same. And Jaden's remains the same. I haven't had to move around a little bit. Yeah. And I tried to start a fire because the mosquitoes such a pain buzzing in my ears. I even got one in my eye. And then uh, I got my flint and seal. I grind up some leaves, and I. Striked a few times and uh, the flint snapped and uh, yeah, I was kind of mad. And now I have to go get a new one. I don't like to buy lighters. Again, I, I like to uh, you know have a struggle getting stuff. So it's actually I got a what is it called tinder? I got to find my own tinder instead of just lighting up a leaf with the lighter. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If you like this video, comment, like it. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you.